wow, this thing cleaned out quite nice, honey. Sit. Can you sit? Ooh. Come on. Sit for the camera. Hey, sit. Oh, that's a good girl. Pretend you like it. The funniest design of this coat is there's actual buttons. It's like you have to like fucking button this. Like, it's legit. <laughs> I was traveling pretty heavily um, up until about Christmas. And I had to be home for obviously the holidays. My friend Steven was getting married. And I had like one more little uh, mural to wrap up. And I was debating like whether I get back on the road and travel or if I actually get a studio and focus on a solo show. Um, and right when I was kind of contemplating all of that, I got a call from somebody in, in Troy who wanted a ton of work. Um, and I knew that it would keep me in Detroit for at least, at least a couple months. Um, so I got a studio. <laughs> Um, and I wanted something inspiring, you know, I didn't want to get like a little apartment or like, I also wanted it to be warm. I've been in some pretty, pretty gnarly studios in Detroit. Um, so I kind of went a little above and beyond, but I'm super happy with the decision I made because the space is inspiring, makes me want to work. Um, but yeah, I'm now here painting full time in Eastern Market. Um, I'm above the Rebel House Art in the EMB Brewery Lofts. And yeah, today my plan is I got this huge roll of watercolor paper and some scaffolding and I'm going to reorganize the studio, pull the easels out and um, tack up huge vertical strips um, of watercolor paper for some tall um, figurative portraits. I'm gonna be doing a modern take on some Renaissance style paintings. Get some, some models in here and I got a ton of fabric. Some more modern colors, but I'm like super in this. This is actually like patio, in the patio furniture section. Um, but I'm hyped on these colors. That's generally what my photography and my paintings lean towards. Um, I got a sewing machine to sew it up decorate some models, build a set, do some photography, and then eventually paint it really tall on these, uh, these strips of paper. All right, Nani, we get to see what's in this box. We get to see what's in this box. and I'll do the others. Slap a wet on here. Uh, let's go in here. Hell yeah. Sweet. So yeah, studio set up, it's clean. Um, I got two massive pieces I can be working on. Um, I'm hyped, I get to bring in some models, shoot some reference images to do a unique take on some classic Renaissance paintings. We're taking this fabric, sewing up some stuff, and uh, yeah, next video should be in the process of making this a reality.